you, you mentioned that these giants, you didn't think they'd be replaced. Today, many of these tools, they cost hundreds of thousands of dollars, millions of dollars, and you have to hire additional people just to run them. You, you can't even yeah. use them out of the box. And, and that's already being that's disrupted by um, product-led growth kinds of tools and more user-friendly tools. But, but you think those companies, they are innovating, they will innovate fast enough to maintain you know, hard to tell. Position. Some will, and some won't. Um, you know, you look uh, at old history in any industry where there's massive change. Some keep up, and some don't. Among the incumbents, almost always, the innovation is driven by a small company. You know, I'm hard pressed in the 40 years of dealing with innovation and innovation only to find one example. One example in 40 years of a large change that was driven by an incumbent or a big company or an expert, almost always it is some entrepreneur driving this change. And, and that's why entrepreneurship is such a great thing. You look at Airbnb, could somebody from Hyatt or Hilton have done that? Look at Uber, could somebody from a taxi company or Hertz or Avis done that? or take SpaceX and Rocket Lab, rocket launch companies. Could somebody from Airbus or Boeing have done, or Lockheed have done that? Not a chance.